what we've been waiting for. I am Alice Idea, and I'm out here on the red carpet waiting for a couple of cool celebrities. Of course, the two finalists and your favorite American Idol alumni as they strut their stuff and headed towards the grand finale. Just who will take it home? I am not sure, but we're getting ready to find out in a few minutes. Stay tuned as the night has only begun. I hear the songs from the places where I was born. I do have to be PC because they both have their strengths, and I think they're both great musicians. You know, I think kind of when it gets down to the final few people on this show, it's, it's not necessarily about talent anymore because they all got here because of their talent. It's about the way the audience feels and those moments they create. Obviously, last night was the uh, was the battle, but tonight's going to be an entertaining show that's going to it's going to make a lot of people happy. They're both winners. They're both they're Absolutely. both great. We were surprised that some of them were eliminated by you know, such a great line of talent. It's just thrilling to, to be a part of the process because you know we, we get them so early on, and, and that's our job. You know, yeah. is to really help them to really stand up to that. At the end of the day, they're both going to have great careers as long as they work hard and trust people around them and uh, put people around them that they trust and just have fun with it and enjoy every minute because it goes by fast. Both of them are, are great and, uh, you know, I try not to, to pick favorites or anything because I remember being on the show and seeing when somebody else would pick somebody other than me and you'd be like, oh man. But, so, uh, you know, I just, I recognize that it's, especially these two girls, they are incredible voices and uh, are going to represent the show well and, and uh, definitely represent the music industry as a whole well. A red dress for the first time on the red carpet. Tell us about this experience. Oh my gosh, being on the red carpet, taking pictures, interviews, and all that stuff, like it is so amazing. And the fact that I'm here supporting my two girls, I couldn't ask for anything else. I'm so honored that I'm actually sharing the stage with people that I have grew up listening to and I've watched on television that have inspired me to be who I am as an artist. Well, speaking of sharing the stage, you were on the stage with Keith, Mariah, Brandy, and Nikki. Like, tell us about that whole experience being up there with those four. It's amazing. Moments uh, only come around in certain seasons at certain times. And so I'm so glad that I've humbled myself enough to, in order to let God take me where I need to go. You know, the judges are so nice. You know, I ran into Keith Urban yesterday, and How he's such a great They're guy. Great. You know, I love all the four judges. I didn't get to spend as much time with them as, as I would like to have if I were to stay a little bit longer, but I love them all. I mean, everybody has been on the show could make something of this moment. It's all about us thinking about there's literally how many thousands of people are singing in a bar this weekend who would kill for this moment and would know what to do with this moment. They're watching TV going, oh, my God, I would know what to do with that moment. That's just don't waste the moment. Nikki is owning the judging panel. <laughs> um, I, I thought Nikki was a tremendous choice for uh, the judging panel this year. Um, you know, historically, Randy has always had the pizzazz and had the clout and been very vivacious on the judging panel. I, I'm sorry, but Nikki outdid him this year. Uh -oh. it, was, uh, it, was, it was amazing. Switch it up and do what you shine at. Don't try to come out here and give us another side. We ain't asked for another side yet. I would tell them to continue to live your dream, even after this is all said and done. I mean, Idol kind of catapulted them to, you know, kind of really quick accelerated um, stardom, but now it's going to be up to them to keep up that hard work. I, they always improve during the course of the season, and they, I think America definitely got it right. These were the, the best two. They all, they were all loved, loved each other. And so you know, when they got down to this last day yesterday, they were really rooting for each other, helping each other out. It was great. You were here last year. What's going through Cree and Candace's head right now? Um, Absolutely everything and absolutely nothing. <laughs> so, I mean, I guess they're just trying to, like, brush it off, you know, trying to stay professional and ease it all in because it is very stressful. I mean, there's a 50-50 chance that both of them could be titled the next American Idol. So, I mean, it's crazy. Um, today is like, not like any other Thursday where you're super nervous. You're just ready to have a good time and, and ready to party. I'm feeling good. I feel like today me and Candace are a lot more relaxed because we've done our part and now it's just all in America's hands at this point. Well, I've had the time of my life, and this, this has been the best experience. So whether it's me or Candace, we're proud of each other. And um, the, the performances tonight are going to be so fun. I can't wait for you all to find out.